Shawnee. Hello, I just arrived here. Uh, here, how do you acquire such knowledge? Because I don't know such things. I don't know where where to start. Uh, you just start consuming info. I've been I've been following politics for decades now, so it's not something you can learn instantly. It's not right. You could take you could take any place in the world right now, right? Uh, take Haiti for example. You could take Haiti and say, okay, you want to know what's going on in Haiti, right? You have decades of history to go through, right? You got decades of history to go through, and it's not just history. You have to dig down, figure out where that history is coming from, right? Because as the saying goes, the winners write the history, right? So a lot of history that we know about the world is not really true history. It's not, right? You have to dig down and fi find out the information that they didn't share or that they lied about or they hid, right? So you can read a book that's written by American propagandists on Haiti, the history of Haiti, and then read another book written by a Haitian that knows the history of Haiti. And it'll be totally two different things, right? So it takes a long time. And doing research on Haiti, figuring out, you know, why it is the way it is right now, it would take you months of reading to catch up months of reading to catch up uh so it's just time uh, you have to remember uh shawnee on uh, um, on twitch the odds are i'm older than you much older than you and i've been going at this for a long time right it's time just make sure you're not being used as cannon fodder by centralized power and know this centralized power governments lie they lie corporate media lies right so don't expose yourself to tons of corporate media and government propaganda because that'll distort you that'll exhaust you if you want to learn the history of a region do first and foremost who some of the independent journalists were from that region and read that history you'll save yourself a lot of time and interact with the people right interact with the people from that region right so there's a lot of people i talk to that you know talk about haiti for example they've never met a haitian in their lives they've never had a haitian friend they've never dated a haitian they've never gone to uh, any presentations about haiti haiti and they say oh haiti is this because cnn bullshit right or CBC bullshit, right? It, it just, it takes time, it takes energy to do it. Uh, it's like education, right? It's education, okay? Uh, Shawnee, the problem is that I for, forget easily. Shawnee, I, how, how, uh, how many live streams have you attended uh, of ours, right? As you know, if you come here, you know that I mix up my names, I mix up my dates. I don't, you know, I, I think I remember something a certain way, but oh, that was a different region or this, 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 this. But those are the minute little things, right? You don't have to worry about the, the, the intricacies of it. You have to, you have to think about the, the flow of it, the macro, right? You can, you can figure out the micro for certain areas for sure. But look at the macro of what's going on. Know who to trust, know who not to trust, right? That's the first couple of orders of business. And the longer you spend with it, the more you'll get to know, the more you'll get to know. First time chat, uh, Pussy Baker, nice name. Uh, my man looking like a, a Buddha of war. <laughs> That's the last thing I want to be, but it is what it is, but it is what it is. By the way, hello, hello, hello. Real Xenomorph, the media is built on lies. As Assange would say, nearly every war in the last 50 years was started due to media lies. 100%. 100%. Mm -hmm. 